this here is the drive into Favorite State Park, just south of St. Augustine, right by where 95 and the US-1 connect at about exit 298. This real pristine, beautiful wildlife area here in Florida. Hello folks, welcome back to the channel. All Wonky Vids, Ant here with you. And today we are at Favor Dykes State Park. We're about five to six miles south of St. Augustine here. Favor Dykes is a park that was granted from Mr. Favor who granted it around 800 plus acres for the state park so that the future generations can enjoy this for generations to come which is I always love these state parks and these wild areas. Beautiful, beautiful part of Florida that, you know, some people don't really see. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna walk around and check out what the Favor Dykes State Park has to offer. So why don't you come along with me? Yes, this first launch here is an ADA accessible, so they actually do have two handicap spots here in case you need to utilize those and then a little sign about the area and the conservation efforts that they put out here in Favor Dykes Park with these longleaf pine forests and the Spanish moss on there is always pretty and then they have some picnic tables and some other picnic tables and seating areas around here and you can also rent kayaks from this area if you take a look at the site there and this pathway is paved all the way and then there's a wooden boardwalk out to where you can access the water from this site. So let's go take a little walk down that. And here's a little sign just about being Florida friendly boating. Here in Florida when you go and you take your kayaks out. You can just take a look at here if you want about this sign. And then over here is the rental canoes and kayaks that you can get. And if you want to get some of these, you do have to go visit the ranger station, which I'll show you later. But here's the sign with the number and the rates of renting. And just come to this little boat launch. And right here is where you can launch. They really make it easy to assist you in launching. If you do happen to be in a wheelchair, here's the instructions on that. And you go out on these beautiful little waterways here and the wind is kind of moving the current, looking like it's coming in from the Atlantic because we are right here on the intercoastal, basically. This is pretty convenient here too. They have a place where you can wash off your kayak or watercraft when you're done with it. Right at the end of the little boardwalk there. Oh yeah, yeah, it's Florida, so uh, don't forget. No feedy or molesty the gators. And there's lots of birds here too. Okay, and if you're continuing down the main road coming in, just past the canoe and kayak boat launch area, you come to the little picnic area here through these um, woods to the long leaf pine forest so we'll go check out this place and see what the picnic area looks like all right it's it's really nice here in this little picnic area they have these pavilions that you can use little shelters with water there as you can see and also barbecue grills and a little fire pit there too several little areas where you can come here with your friends or family and just enjoy being out here in the nature and also if you have the kiddos I'm sure they're going to enjoy this little playground this is this is a really nice little playground for being right here in a state park then also at the picnic area they do have the restrooms but yeah it's just really nice here all these picnic tables and these shelters nestled amongst these longleaf pine trees beautiful all right, I always like to check out the bathrooms to see how they are. And this one here at 
Beaver Dyke State Park actually has clean restrooms, they're really clean, and flushing toilets, as well as being ADA accessible. This, this is a really friendly park here to come check out. And we're only about 10 miles or so from St. Augustine. Nice. And just past the picnic shelter area is the boat ramp or a turn off towards the ranger station and the campground. But let's go check out the boat ramp first and see what it looks like. And here is the actual boat launch area of the park. You got some people kayaking out there. So several spots to put out here in this little park, but this is really convenient if you have a boat and a truck and a trailer. Nothing too big, but definitely fits some decent sized stuff in here. There's also a nice little bathroom here with flush toilets too at the boat ramp. And here is a nice little information sign about the mangroves here in the area. And also, what have I caught? The different kind of fish species that you can catch here in the Florida waters and around this area. So that you can identify what you have and if it's currently legal and in season to keep that fish. Okay, right now we are heading to the campground area of Favor Dyke State Park. So we can get a look at both the ranger station, the campground, and also there's a few nature trails in that area. Okay, and right in front of the campground is the main ranger station. There's a vault toilet, pit toilet here, so that means um, a toilet, but non-flushing. And then they have this little fountain here. And then also some, this is the head to uh, the Pine Loop Nature Trail, which is about 0.8 miles round trips, about a mile going round. And then you can also go on the Plantation Loop Trail, which is a little over two and a half miles. And this here is in the name of Hiram Favor, who actually donated all these acres to the park. It was about 700 acres that he donated to the state of Florida to be saved in perpetuity for all the people for pleasure and recreation and it was dedicated in 1951 and today this park encompasses over 6,000 acres. So thank you Mr. Favor. This is a beautiful park and the state is doing a great job of maintaining it. And there's some other information no, on this placard here too. A little history of the area and Indians and different things that went on here. And another historical placard here. And then right here is the trailhead. And here on these trails, you do have to watch out for ticks and other bugs and stuff here. So bring your incident repellent or wear clothes that can keep off ticks and then they do have trail maps right here at the beginning as well as when at the pay station yeah see here's the little trail map when you open it up it has a little satellite view of the park and all the different trails that you can have so i would advise taking one of these if you're going to go walk around the little trails here and check out the park and here is the camper registration here at the ranger station. Here is the different kind of fee schedules for camping here at Favor Dykes. Looks like for tent camping, it's $26.77 a night. RVs are about $35. And you can take a look here and see the other fees here. But really not too bad. And um, you can pay for one night using this self-service registration, but that means that the site is um, available for one night only. And then other information about the area. And here is a list of the different campsites and where they are located. And here's the little self-serve pay station. 
and the rest of the little ranger station. And I do got to say, all the rangers that I have met here so far and even seen some interactions with their other guests here, they've been very friendly and knowledgeable. This loop here is the campground area of Favor Dyke State Park. They all have electrical and water and hookups to these sites. And if I see any open sites, I'll, I'll try and get a closer look for you guys here of what these campsites look like. Okay, I just wanted to show one of these ADA accessible sites. This one's site number 11. Clearly has just like a concrete pad. So, depending on where you have a vehicle or trailer set up, you can do that. Or even a tent, little tent space right here if you just wanted to put a tent up on the grass. Picnic table. And then, since it's the ADA one, it has a concrete path right to the restrooms. And then also a fire pit with a little grill thing on top. And then you have your line here where you can hang up clothes or towels to dry. Then yeah, this is a complete concrete pad because it is ADA accessible. Okay, and this particular site, Site 17. This one is not an ADA one, so it just has like the dirt flattened out foundation here where you can put a tent or... I do see a lot of travel trailers and stuff like that here. And then, as you can see, they also have any electrical hookups you may need. 30 watt and whatever the other one is and then also a place where you can hook up some fresh water here to your travel trailer or whatever you're using and then also a picnic table and a fire pit with a little grill thing on top here as well as another hanging line hanging place and you're nestled among these beautiful beautiful trees and long leaf pines along with some of these other trees and all the Spanish moss growing off it. Really nice little location for a campground. And then you have another site right there, site 18 across the way there. And here is the bathrooms here at the campsite. And they do have a dump station here too if you need to use that for your RV or travel trailer. A nice flush toilets and showers in that bathroom. So all in all, Favor Dykes is a great state park here. Very natural. The bathrooms were clean. The picnic areas and everything were nice and clean. And the campground was very nice too. As well as the rangers all being friendly and helpful for everything that I've seen. And also, this state park is conveniently located about just a maybe half hour south of St. Augustine. So you know what I say. The Favor Dykes State Park, 100% recommend. All right, thank you for joining me today. I always appreciate you guys coming on these adventures with me. So if you like this video, don't forget to click that like down below there. It really helps out my channel and helps out helps to show YouTube that you guys enjoy my content. And then also, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and keep up with all my adventures that I'm going on around here in Florida and beyond. So thank you to everyone, and as always, be good to yourself, be good to each other, and hope you have a nice day. Peace.